ask you a few questions, a little interview, just for a second. I just had a question if you had saw this morning's. Yes, well, I can ask both of you. Yes, I can ask. I'm really shy. That's all right. Have some wine. I should. It, it always help. It helps me. I was just wondering if you had seen this morning's interview with Dylan Avery and the Loose Change Group. You heard it. What did you think? What did you think of it? bustling around doing other things. I was a little shocked at one point. In what way? Somebody we both in what remembered, way? We both say remembered the same that way. called somebody a liar. That's what I remembered. Like, I didn't watch the whole thing at all. And you thought that was... I just, it stopped me in my tracks and getting any tips. Did you listen to some of the information, the, the content? Do you have any feelings on it? Unfortunately, what? as I said, I wasn't focusing. What do, what do you okay. think of... Um, this is the second time Amy has uh, dealt with the 9-11 truth movement. She had David Ray Griffin on. Where are you from, by the way? I'm from Connecticut. No, no, I originally. mean, like, what, what are you doing this? What is this? Oh, I'm just doing, I, I came here as part of 9-11 truth, and I'm just a uh, big fan of Amy's, and I've come here to ask about 9-11 truth and the react, you know, the response of her fans and her volunteers and what they thought of this morning and, and the issue of 9-11 truth in the bigger picture. How does, it, how does it fit into our general anti-war, anti-globalization? I mean, it's been an ongoing debate. And uh, the fact that Amy had it on today is, is, a, is a very, you know, that's, that's substantial. And so I want to know how those in the anti-war movement, those in the anti-globalization environment feel about 9-11 Truth and feel about um, Amy's role in bringing it out and, and, you know, stepping out now. And should she continue? And what do you think the role of 9-11 Truth is? And these are just your opinions. I'm really uninformed on it. Mm -hmm. I'm uninformed. I can't give you an educated opinion on it at this point. I just don't know enough about it. I admire what Amy Goodman does. I, I do too. So if she, if she had it on, there, you know, there's something, there, maybe there's some substance to it, but I'm just completely uninformed. It made, I hate cats, but it made me want to see the work. And it made me want to to read more about what it's called, the loose, mm -hmm. I, I loose can't remember, change, yes. loose change. It makes me want to see that, hear it. So when Amy has it on, you say, if Amy chooses to have it on... No, 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 I'm saying when I heard what was oh, okay. going on, I, exactly, it's, you know, during 9-11 right away, yes, everyone's talking about these conspiracies, and I haven't heard one full, like, direct idea, you hear brief, I think it's too quick, and there's not something more thorough to say, here's an idea. Today's show was a little bit battling and, and maybe, you know, it made me want to know more, you know, and it was very controversial, controversial, but yeah, it makes me just want to understand more about what this idea is because it was lost over, you know. Would you like Amy to cover it more or get more informed like I've gotten some other, Paul Thompson and some others, um, is there anyone that you know that you'd like her to put that? you think represents the movement, if you have any understanding, and you say, that'd be a good person for Amy to have on. Um, yeah, I'm not, I'm anybody not sure. I, mean, I don't know. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. not quite sure if I have anything to respond on that. Okay. I mean, Wonderful. I think I would like to see more definitely, and a more conclusive, you know, exactly. Today felt really easy. Right. And again, you're trying to cover seven different ideas of what happened, and of course, yes, Case, if this is something that she believes strongly in, then yes, it should be looked more thoroughly and more slowly, which is why I think democracy now works. You know? Great. Thank you so much. You're